Hi everyone, this is the gas walkthrough for November 25th, I believe. Um, I'm recording this early, uh, but this is what Bill said he's planning to post on the 25th. Um, it is Point to Next Sudoku by Bill Murphy. And we have normal Sudoku rules apply, 1 to 9 inch row column and 3 by 3 box. Um, additionally, we have some arrows in the grid. And these arrows tell us that the digit immediately following that arrow must be somewhere in the direction of the arrow. So if we look at this arrow, if this were a 6, it would be telling us that there is a 7 somewhere here. Now a lot of these only point to one cell, so that's going to tell us that whatever this is, this is one higher. So that's going to be useful. Um, but those are the rules, and we'll start with this box. And I can see in this box already, um, whatever this is, this one's going to be one higher, this one's going to be one higher than this, and this one's going to be one higher than this. So we have three pairs of digits. We're going to have a 4-5, we're going to have a 6-7, we're going to have an 8-9. The 4 can't go in either of these, so this must be 4-5. And then these must be 6-8 with 7-9 up here, but there's a 9 here. So that resolves like that. We've got the same thing in this box, in fact, in all the corner boxes. Uh, so we're going to do something similar here. In this case, we have 3, 4, and 7, so our pairs are 1, 2, and then 5, 6, and then 8, 9. This can't be 1, and this can't be 2, so this is not 1 either, so this is 1, 2. These can't be 5, so this is 5, 6, and then this is 8, 9. Okay, down here, our pairs are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. These can't be 1, so 1, 2 like that. This can't be 3, so this is 3, 4, 5, 6. And down here, we need 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. These can't be 4, so this is 4, 5. This can't be 2, 3, because of this 2. And then this is 6, 7. So those are all the corner boxes done. And now let's look at some of these arrows in between. So these are 1, 3, and 8. However, this can't be 3 or 8 because the digit following those, 4 and 9, is not up here. This must be 1, pointing at the 2. And then this is 8, 3 because of this 3. Here we have 4, 7, 9. This can't be 7 because of the given digit. And 9 is never going to go in an arrow because we can't place 10 in these cells. So that's 4 pointing at this 5. Uh, these are 2, 3, 6. And the only one with the next digit is the 7 here. So that's 6, 2, 3 by this 3. And then these are 1, 5, 8, and they are resolved by the digits we've already placed over here. All right, up here we have 2, 5, and 9. This can't be 9 because of the arrow. These are 3, 4, and 8. And now this can't be 5, it must be 2, 3. And the 8 results for 8 here. These are 1, 6, 7. Down here we get 2, 6, and 9. This can't be 9. These are 1, 7, 8. So this must be 6, 7 so that this is pointing at the next digit. Uh, these are 1 and 8 from this 8. There's also a 2 up here, so 9 and 2. Uh, the 1 looks up for 6, 1, and 7 from these. These are 3, 4, 5, and that should be resolved as well. The 5 resolves 9 and 5. All right, now we're just looking at the middle here. Um, these are 2, 4, and 9. It's not 4, that's not 2. These are 1, 5, 6. And those are resolved like that. These are 5, 7, 9. Now we know this is not 9. This could be 5 or 7 because it's pointing at both 6 and 8. This is not 7. This is not 5. And then here we have 2, 4, 6. So we get 2, 6, and 4 from these. The 2 places a 9, 4, 2. 
the 9 places 5, 7, 9. And finally, 7 and 9 here. And I didn't get a completion. Um, it could be that there's no solution given. Um, but I did want to point out there's a deadly pattern here, if not for this arrow. Um, this arrow is preventing putting a 9 here. Uh, so that's uh, apart from symmetry. That's why that arrow is there. Let's click check. It says that's not the solution, um, but let's check just to make sure. Um, I can always cut this out later, I guess. Uh, so the 8 is pointing to the 9, the 6 is pointing to 7, 4 is pointing to 5, 2 is pointing to 3, 5 is pointing to 6, 1 is pointing to 2, 8 to 9, 6 to 7, 4 to 5 to 6, 3 to 4, 1 to 2, 6 to 7, 4 to 5, 2 to 3, 6 to 7, 7 to 8, 1 to 2. So that's all the arrows. And we didn't get a notification that any of the Sudoku is wrong. So I believe this is the solution. Um, I'll ask Bill to check it after I upload it and make sure there's not some problem that I'm missing. Um, anyway, that is hopefully the solution to the puzzle. Um, so let us know how you did in the comments, and I will see you next time.